Hi, I'm Brian Morris from Relish. You know, it's finally starting to cool off outside, and I want to show you one of my favorite salads for this time of year. It's the autumn apple salad with creamy maple dressing. It's super easy to make. It's great for an outdoor dinner party and even for your holiday table. And it all starts with the creamy maple dressing. To make this, we're gonna start with some Hungry Jack Microwave Ready Original Pancake Syrup. About three tablespoons of this. This is gonna give us a great sort of complex, rich sweetness that's gonna be really nice. Next, we'll add about three tablespoons of mayo to that to make it creamy. To give the dressing a little acidity, we'll add about two tablespoons of white wine vinegar. Now to punch up the sweetness of the maple syrup and round off the vinegar, about a teaspoon and a half of granulated sugar. Now, salt and pepper to taste. And finally, a third of a cup of uh, Crisco pure canola oil. This is a great choice for a dressing because the flavor is clean and pure and won't get in the way of the other flavors. Also, it's cholesterol free and trans fat free so you can feel good about using it. Now we'll whisk all of these ingredients together to form our nice creamy dressing. Now a little taste. Mmm, it's perfect. I'm gonna add just a little more salt though. Now we'll move this out of the way while we get our other salad ingredients together. It starts with mixed baby greens. You could use your favorite greens for this. To give it a little fall flavor, I'm gonna add some sliced apples. You could also use pears. Some dried cranberries. These will go great with the maple syrup. And some toasted walnuts. You could use pecans or your favorite nuts for this. Now a pinch of salt and pepper right to the salad. and just enough of our creamy maple vinaigrette to coat. We don't want it swimming in dressing. All right, I think that'll be plenty. Now we'll toss it up. Yes, yeah, that's just the right amount of dressing. Every leaf is nicely coated, but it's not soaking wet or soggy. Now we'll transfer this to a bowl. We'll top it with a few more of our sliced apples, our dried cranberries, and toasted walnuts, and we're ready to enjoy. Mm. I love the flavors of the maple, the clean flavor of the canola oil, the sweetness of the apples, and the cranberries. It's delicious. It's one of my favorite autumn recipes, and I hope it becomes one of yours too. Till next time, I'm Brian Morris with Relish. See you soon. Thank you.